Welcome back to the Ghost Key. I'm Gray, and today we have more of what you need. And what you need is some more Rome Total War. That's right. So, anyway, if you remember last time we got lucky, we were able to expand a few places and shit. So, we're going to continue doing so. Um, hopefully. Maybe. If we are lucky. Um, I don't know what to build here. Uh, ch -ch 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 -ch. we have a shrine already. Practice field probably be a good idea. Workshop, mayhaps. I'm not really in the ballistas all that much. And we don't really need town growth, so I guess we'll go with some outskirts. How's that sound? Make some monies. Monies, bitches. Monies. And shit. Um. Because we do need monies. Absolutely, we need monies. Need monies like you just don't know. Um. The Lions of Tanit. Love the name of some of these armies. They have some cool. Appropriately named armies. Um. Just in case we have, like, any, uh, sudden malfunctions or I rage the fuck out, just to let you know, I am literally surrounded by cats right now. I have my cat sitting on the chair that I was going to use. She decided to bogart that shit before I sat the fuck down, and now I have Roto on my lap because he's being a needy little shit today. So, um, yeah. So if you hear anything like bump the fucking table or some shit, that'll be Frodo's. So anyhow, all right. So what we want to do is recruit some units, I think. Um, I think that's going to be wise here soon. Um, so yeah, let's get, actually let's get eaten up some turns here. Um, I should tell you this, um, there probably will be a point um, during which I will cease playing this LP for a while, take a little bit of a break from it. Um, Rome is typically a longer game anyhow. Um, so that's kind of why, um, usually these campaigns take quite some time and I haven't exactly been just sitting on my ass twiddling my thumbs while playing this game. I mean, I think I've kind of, um gone through here with with some relative pace um so like i said there may be a point where this is kind of on hold for a little bit um so when that happens um don't get too upset um like i said i will probably mention something in the video that's going to be the last one for a while i will most likely say yeah no we're probably not going to play this for some time shit like that um for, you know, pretty obvious reasons, I think. So, there's that. So, just to let you know, that's kind of a heads up. I was thinking about not recording this today. I'm like, oh, you know. This is one of those games that sometimes, like, I... It takes me a while. Not really, it takes me a while to get into it. But once I get to it, and, like, and actually start playing it, it's like, oh, fuck. You know, I, it's, it's a hard game to put away. It really is. When you jump into it, it's like, oh, I don't really want to play this. And then you get into it, and you're like, oh, fuck, this is kind of fun. And you just don't stop. You just don't stop. It's just the way it is. It's just the way it is. So, with that in mind, <laughs> we are, uh, like I said, we're probably, I'm still probably still going to play this for a while. Quite honestly, this is something that's kind of a filler right now, um... I, uh, mostly because the girlfriend and I, because she's been working a lot of overtime, not by design, mind you, just the nature of her job, she ends up having to work quite a bit of overtime every once in a while, and it will probably pick up here this fall, too, because they usually have outage and shit, she works at a power plant, and uh, they usually have a lot of extra shit to do around then, and, um, so, yeah, that will probably be a thing, um, come, uh, come this fall and go all that good shit so with that in mind um this is like i said this is kind of just a this is really just a filler uh 
show, I guess, if you want to call it. Um, so, yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, I hate to, like, I hate to kind of take out these and call them that, but, I mean, that's kind of really what it is. It's just something for me to do when she's not here. The stuff that actually draws people to the channel, which is, uh, fucking Lord of the Rings, oddly enough. Um, tends to get pretty, teams, teams? Tends to do the best out of all the shit that I have, um, up on the channel, which is fine with me. The problem is we just haven't had a lot of time recently, and quite honestly, Pokemon is a thing that's kind of easy, and we don't have to go really get too much for but I am working on recording that in a different way, um, so that I can record that. We can record that, I should say, a little more, um, a little more consistently. Because as of right now, we're not really able to record consistently because of, like I said, all the extra overtime she's had to do and all that good shit. But like I said, um, hopefully I'll be able to work out a way to get around that. And this is Balhamon. That's what I've been looking for. I keep coming over here. I'm like, what the fuck am I looking for? God damn it! I'm just trying to figure out what shrine I want to put together. I put. The other shrine of Tenet, I think. Go we'll go with that. Yeah, we'll go with that. Yes, yes. I think we will recruit. We should recruit more melee units. Methinks. Now nah, that is all of our cash. Use the fuck up. Um. Ooh. Uh, before we do, hit that next turn button. Uh huh. You are in Kartuba. You're Carlos. Halkin was over here at. Nope. Sapadam, Suniatis, Merbal. This is. Is this the guy? Tisseras. Shit. I don't know who it was. I think it's this guy. I think. Mm hmm. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna start working on, um, boy, shit. Yeah, you're in Taraku, yeah, you're over there. Okay, so you, we're gonna want Egg Ball, Walls of Bursa. Fuck, I really wish I could, I think you can, actually. I think you can switch generals to different armies. But they both have to kind of be in the same place. So, we got him here in Taraku. I would really appreciate them attacking me. Like I said, this is just... This is better, that being there is better than them raiding for obvious reasons. This raiding's bullshit. Especially when it's one unit of fucking dudes tearing shit up. Anyhow, alright, we're gonna end this turn right there. Um, so yeah, I know I promised, or I intended to do some, uh, some, some Pokemon top fives, if you will. Top sixes in our case. Um, that has yet to come to fruition, but I'm really trying to push for the girlfriend to kind of get that shit done so I can. Because I want to, yeah, fuck you guy. Get the hell out of here. Because I really want to do that. That That's something that I really want to do. So, that that does remind me. I do need to text her and be like, hey, can you finish that one drawing so I can do the, the, the thing? And shit. So, um, there's that I wanted to talk about. But, um, yeah, like I said, at some point, um, this will probably be relegated to, uh, to, well, not relegated, just kind of put on hold at some point, most likely. Um, just for, like I said, for all intents and purposes, it'll just be one of those things that kind of just, it's, it's a, like I said, it's a long, long game when you play it and, and stuff, so it's, it's just one of those things that, after a while, you just need a break from it. And like I said, that's probably going to be something that will happen. And with that in mind, you know, just be aware that if this doesn't get put up and if you're really looking for it, if you really want to watch it, that's why. It's not because I gave up on it, just because, you know, it's not there, not being put up because I'm kind of taking a break from it. Need a break from it. Shit like that. So, yeah, that's that. We really need to start pumping some. Uh, we we need. Oh shit! 
you deconned everything over here last turn, didn't you? Yeah, that's what I thought. All right, so what do we want to build here? I think we are going to want a gathering place. Let's go with a gathering place. And now we have no monies because we're using that shit up like crazy. But that's okay. That's oh fucking k. Because, yeah. That's right. That's what I'm talking about. I think I'm going to put... You know, I think I... I think over here I'm gonna put like a good naval shipyard or something like that and build like combat boats and shit. That's the thing I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna fucking change this into a, was it the shipwright? Nope, it's the military wharf. Duh, it says fucking military in it. That's what I think I'm gonna put right here at Alalia. Um, not only for the garrison, but to create a bunch of shit there at Carlos. I think that's a good idea to kind of put together a place that, you know, make it a real fucking thorn in Rome's side and make it just one big fortified as fuck island that they can't get to that they can't you know hopefully like I said they'll attack I really want to do it I really want to go take Ebera should we do that now mm. Mm. you're still building shit I don't want to wait until I don't want to wait until they get shit built up. I mean, we got a decent garrison here at Cartuba. Cartuba. We'll we'll wait. I think we'll we'll wait two turns. I think, and then we'll get going that way. Cause I want to get I want to get that happiness and all that shit stabilized real quick before we before we jump over there. I mean, I don't think they've got anything in that region right now. I don't know where this fucking asshole up there is fucking going. What I might do, ah, oh, fuck, see? Now they're starting to garrison an army at Ebera, so that means we're gonna have to hasten our, uh, hasten our plans here, I think, by one turn, and start moving in that direction. Um, because I'm not about to let them just fucking get a giant ass army and then have to fucking wait around forever. So we'll go ahead and do that. Alright, yeah, you're much better than I thought you would. Faction destroyed. Who got destroyed? Liguria. I don't think I've ever encountered them in this game. That's one thing that's really cool. Is like, every time you play this game... Every time you play this game... Like, you're... Like, the... The, the um... Factions you encounter are likely to be different. You know what I mean? Like I said, like, I've never encountered Liguria. I mean, I'm sure if I played some other campaign and actually encountered that faction and shit. It's cool stuff, if you ask me. It's cool shit indeed. Um, yeah, I need you to be that. Jesus, we got all sorts of fucking cool shit to build. I'm gonna try something new. Like I said, I've, I've never, never used... I just, I, I just don't get into the naval warfare. It's just one of those things that I'm just, I think I, tr yeah, I tried it a few times on, um, Shogun 2, but I never got into it. I didn't play Empire all that much. I need to play Empire, actually. I want to play that game. I do. Empire Total War. That was one of the cooler, cooler ones. I kind of like the idea, but anyway. It's much different economically, though, than, than any of these games, so it would take a lot of adjusting on my part. I think what I'm going to do, I think what I should do is, this is what I'm going to do, fucking, fuck it. Alright, I'm going to bring you, bring you down here and take a look at the match. Yeah. So I think what I want to do is this. I think I'm going to swap this guy with the walls of Bersa. Move the walls of beers towards Numantia. And then, um, and then, and then take it, because we don't have anyone threatening to attack, and I want to get, oh, fuck. You're not the one that I wanted to do that with. I wanted you to go over here. God damn it. Alright, so I think that's what I'm going to do, yeah. Because we have no one coming to attack. Taraco. I don't think anyone can get... I mean, we can't see anyone, so likely no one can get there and attack it in one turn. I mean, it's not 
necessarily undefended either. Numantia sort of is. And in order to round up Cartagenensis or Genensis, whatever the hell it is, we're going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to hasten that now and get him. I want you to go, yeah, you garrison into Taraka. Because if we take Numantia, that'll probably give ours a decent amount of, uh, you know, coverage. Plus, if we ever see anyone coming, we can just take whoever's into Taraka and move them on down the arse. So, that's my, that's my thought there. So, I think, yeah, alright, so we're good for this turn. Let's have you, I should have had you do your thing for some time. Barakas! Alright, go time. So, anyway, um, I don't think there's anything else I need to update on the channel or say anything about or talk about. I don't think, anyway. So, I think we're good. I think, I think the air has been cleared. I think you understand where I'm coming from. But like I said, um, we're, I'm working on a new way to record Pokemon so that we can have more time to play um, Lotro. Because that's something that I do want to play. Oh, you son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. Alright, so you, Skatari Spearman, these are the ones that I'm kind of worried about. Uh, Iberian Swordsman and the Veteran Shield Warriors. Seriously, he's versing Gatorix? That's fucking badass. Bad fucking ass. I think we do want to fight them here. I wish I would have fucking been able to hold him at the bridge. That would have been nice. I don't know how he was able to cross the bridge like that, considering we just stayed in there. And our zone of control should have prevented him from going around there, but... What the fuck ever, right? We're at least fighting here. Fuck, I don't like how they got two different fucking ways to get at me, though. That pisses me off. I'm pissed. Raging pissed. Raging pissed. Um, I think... Oh, fuck. That could be a thing. That could be a thing. Pretty sure they're gonna be... Oh, no, they probably won't be split up. But they have those fucking... That ballast, so that's gonna piss me off. Oh, yeah, that'll... Irritate me quite a bit. So, I think I got an idea of what to do here. I think I know what I want to do. I think. Good thing is, I think what we're gonna do is gonna take a small, like three spears. This is one, one, two, three, four. Yeah, uh, two units of four spear units. Stationed over here. I'll have one of three and my cavalry up here in this corner because what I want to do is I want to sweep my cavalry around But I want my spear units up there just in case They decide to do something stupid Stop that you bastard Hit how all I gotta do is press shift and that shit comes up. God, that's irritating All right, cuz yeah, that's what I want. That's what we want to do. We want to stick you fuckers up here with my cavalry, my general and my dudes. Um, fuck, this is gonna get messy if I do it this way. I think. Fuck it. We're just gonna go with you over there. Because what I wanna do is, since they've got that ranged shit over there, I'm gonna wanna bring this, bring them down and across, okay? And the rest of you. Wait, what? Why do I have... Why? Oh. Did they build a fucking bridge? They did, didn't they? Or can you do that? Is that a thing? Is that indeed a thing? Oh, well, that's some weird shit. Look at that. You see that? I don't think that's supposed to happen. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, that just makes things more... <clears throat> Ooh, ideas. Lots more ideas. Ooh. 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 
Ooh. Okay, see now I'm thinking now I'm thinking way too much. Alright, so actually let's bring let's bring you fuckers down here. Cause I don't think they'll be bye Frodo. I don't think they'll be so stupid as to Could be wrong though. No. Could be wrong. Probably am. So I am gonna wanna do though. Is I am going to want to take care of that Abalista as soon as possible. What we're gonna do is this. Alright, I got a better idea. Alright, we're gonna have the two units of of spears over here. Okay. Oh fuck me, that's not what I want. With these guys, these homeboys. Um, with the idea of one of these hopefully fights off whatever the fuck's over here. Theoretically, What's going to happen is nothing over here, and we can just sweep our cavalry this way. Okay. Call this Perfectenschlag. That's right. Do I want to do it? No. Maybe. Where the fuck are you assholes going? I don't think you can throw your shit that far. Yeah, you do have one unit of... I bet you these are their reinforcements that are coming up over here. Oh, what the fuck? Fuck, which one are you? There we go. And now they're gonna get just fucking pummeled. Just fucking pummeled. They shouldn't be able to hit them from there. Yeah, that's what I thought. I don't, I don't think there's slingers yeah, that sort of fucking range. Okay, so you are gonna wait. However, I think now's a good time to bring these guys across the water at least. Hit them. They should be within range here shortly. Jesus Christ. They're not gonna. Fine. I'm gonna move everyone. Oh, I got an idea. Alright. Because I don't want to be... Are they firing? I don't think they're firing. I don't think they can yet. Oh my god, you motherfucker. Damn it. That's all I'm afraid of. Because of their ranged superiority. Alright. Fuck, what are you? You are four. Okay, let's just keep doing what I'm doing here. Because I don't want... Damn it. They're just going to fucking sit over there, too. Fucking bastards. Jesus Christ. How in the fuck? How in the fuck are you able to hit me from that fucking far away? So I'm just gonna keep overlapping them, keep bringing them back here, because that's really what I need. I don't need them to. Jesus Christ. You're gonna have to either bring them across. That's my fault. I should have fucking realized that they just fucking line them up with the goddamn water there. How in the hell do you seriously have that much range? You've got to be fucking kidding me. Got to be fucking kidding me. Oh my god, are you fucking serious? Bullshit. 
bullshit. There's no way. No way you can fucking hit me from there. That's fucking bullshit. God damn. Sorry, but siege weaponry in this fucking game, over fucking powered. Too much fucking range, seriously. The fact that you can fucking sit there with four of these goddamn things and just fucking throw that shit at me from the other side of the fucking map is bullshit. And with fucking stupid accuracy too. Jesus, you see that shit? I don't know how you fuckers can hit from there. Well, there just goes this fucking fight. We just lost this shit. God damn it. And they're just gonna sit there. They're really just gonna sit there, aren't they? You need to move, don't you? No? Seriously, this is bullshit. Bullshit. Come on. This is one thing I fucking don't like about this fucking shit either. Let us fucking do shit like this and then just sit here. Just fucking sitting here. So now I'm forced now to then go after him. When they're the aggressors, but hey, whatever. There we go. Now you're fucking moving at least. Just waiting for you to move. Oh my god, are you fucking serious? Jesus Christ. Oh my fucking. Push the right fucking button, will ya? Alright, so now at least they're doing that thing. We're gonna go and across over here. I guess I'll move you there. You need to be moving faster than you're moving. Seriously. Yeah, the thing that I, I don't like is the fact that when you're moving, they have such good accuracy. That's the thing that's fucking bullshit. If you ask me, just bullshit. Good thing is though, guess what they don't have over here? Spears. Oh, their spears are going that way. That's good for us, cause you know what we're doing? We're gonna run these motherfuckers down. That's what we're gonna goddamn do. No, their fucking cavalry is coming back. Cause like, oh shit, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? See, now we got those guys, they're not firing anymore, they're just there. And they're only spearmen, or spearmen, swordsmen, so we should have the, should, being the operative word, have the advantage here. Although, we are starting to lose quite a few troops. But this is what we're going to do. Run away, probably take all these damn spears in the back. Or whatever they throw, I don't even know what they throw, quite honestly. Fucking disaster. We got them off of the fucking ballasts, though. Or whatever the fuck you have. Ballasts, yeah. Like I said, ranged units. Ranged units. Fucking whatever they are. Fucking ballasts is too good. Siege units. There we go. Those are the words that I'm fucking looking for. And this is their general unit, isn't it? Yep, that's what I thought. They're fucking nobles and shit. Jesus. And that's something too. Like, slingers can do stupid amounts of damage sometimes. Stupid! But we got these fucking assholes here shortly, so... 
Hopefully. Why are you just standing there? Sweet Christ. Not a good day. So much for taking Ebra in the next fucking turn or two. Jesus. It's all because of those fucking cheap ass fucking balances. I hate that shit. Hate that shit. Rot those motherfuckers. Alright, turn and get these guys. Fucking Christ. So. Come on, everyone get in there. There is one thing that I don't really like about this game. Infantry is certainly, uh, or infantry, cavalry is certainly, um, gimped. I mean, these guys have no, no reason to, to, uh, to really have much of an advantage over cavalry these fucking swordsmen and you can't like charge and retreat like you're supposed to either you pretty much have to fucking just run in there and eat it I mean it's just the way it is unfortunately god damn it I'm gonna fucking lose this unit right over here these guys good thing is they're starting to move things over here a little bit All right, attack these assholes. They're just standing there. Sometime today would be great. Just great. Jesus. Not a good day. Not a good day at all. It's all because, like I said, everything was going fine, and then that goddamn... Good. By fucking time I heard some fucking good news. Oh no, don't do that. Fucking misclick. Oh good, they fucking destroyed them all. Alright, run away. You guys run. Because I said so. Alright. And these guys should be on the ropes. Of course, half of these fuckers over here the whole time were just standing around doing nothing, really. Alright, you, come this way. Just surround these fucking bitches. Make it sometime today, please. That'd be, that'd be wonderful. Just wonderful. Yes, just go, go all defensive on me, please. Sometimes I wonder, are you really throwing shit or are you just pretending to throw shit? I think they're just pretending to throw shit. Run sometime today, please. Oh, I guess we can't have horses hanging out on that. Oh, okay, they are throwing shit. Good. Because that's kind of important. That is one thing I kind of do like, but I don't like. I do like the fact that ranged units are much more effective and actually are useful in, in this game but at the same time it takes some adjusting in all honesty yes fucking better be damn it shit I mean goddamn <sighs> well that's that if you're tuning in to see me get my ass kicked you just did you're welcome. Fuck. All because, see, that's, like I said, that's the one thing I hate about ballistas in this game. They're stupid effective. Too much accuracy. I think that's what it is. Like, I don't mind them hitting so hard, but the fact that they're able to hit units on the move like that, I mean, damn, that's some good math if they're able to figure out the trajectory and all that shit to fucking hit goddamn infantry on the move. But anyhow, that's that. Theoretically, I unless there's some other army they got hanging out somewhere, there's really nothing left for them 
to defend Ebra or Olasipo with. Theoretically. Of course, that unit kind of came out of the middle of nowhere, but that's fine. That's not really... Wasn't really a fight that we should have lost. Anyway, this is this goddamn battle has made it way, way more uh, costly than it should have been. Um, yeah, fuck that shit. That's all there's to it. So we did lose a couple units of spears, so we'll have to spend some time recruiting. Good thing is this though, um, since we've built. Katuba and all that good shit the way we did um regenerating troops in this area won't shouldn't be too bad it should be only a few turns and we'll be close to full strength um and i think we'll have to kind of uh expedite our attacks on ebera just so we don't end up with another super costly siege and shit because i was really hoping to just roll them up and call it good but uh, that's obviously not going to happen this time. So, um, or at least anytime soon. We gotta. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. I love those little fights. They're so cute. The guy's like, ah, oh, shit. Be nice. Nah, I'm gonna kill him because I'm a dick and I'm mad. Ah, fuck you, fuck you. Get the fuck out of here. Nobody loves you. But anyhow, so that's that. We now should have a relatively clear path to uh, Cartuba, Ebera. Ah, uh, so yeah, like I said, oh, we're not too bad. They're no, not too bad. Not too bad at all, really. I think we'll sit for like one turn or something like that, and then move on, maybe. Hmm. Hmm. I think I. Oh, fuck you. Fucking zone of control shit. Should be. Should be all right. Right there. All right. So anyhow, now that that is taken care of, we can finally figure out how to fucking move these guys and continue moving you towards Numantia. That's good because I thought there was an army somewhere out here, but now we've destroyed it. So that means, yeah, Numantia is just wide open to be taken. I mean, there's nothing guarding it whatsoever. Brigantium up there, I think we'll leave that till the very end. Walls of Bursa, I'm thinking from here on out, take out Numantia, move on to Arakilum, and then, um, that's that and then that's all of the iberian peninsula for us and then like i said i think we'll kind of pause the western expansion for a little bit and then concentrate over here in the italian peninsula and take take over that shit um i have no idea how long this episode's been but we're gonna keep going for for now at least um because i really want to go take Ebera. damn it i really want to expand and snag Ebera from them and call it good and be like fucking yeah and accomplish something other than just moving fucking dudes around and fighting once of course that fight did take 15 minutes but hey yeah go back to Ebra and recruit some bitches bitch so depending on how how much we we um we uh regen repopulated re Recouped our cost here. Uh, <sighs> mm, mm, mm. I'll go one more turn, I think, and then I think we'll be all right. Worries me though, this asshole. Now he's starting to get some troops, and which means the siege of Ebera is going to be it's going to be a real fight. A real fight, arg. However, we can, in the meantime, go snag Demantia from him. And complete this little region thing going on we got. Going on we got? Little thing we got going on here. Alright, so we are going to do this. We're going to assault this bitch. And call it good. 
kind of wish, quite honestly, I think the walls of Birsa would have been better suited for that fight. Um, just because they had more cavalry, we probably would have been able to freaking roll them up nice and easy, but um, that necessarily wasn't the case. Um, yeah, I think we'll do this fight, and then um, I think we're done pretty much with this episode. I don't know how long we've been going. We've been going for some time, so... Like I said, that last fight was supposedly 15 minutes. I don't know if that counts the, um, if it just counts off the total timer that you have. Ooh. I'm gonna wait, because I don't want to fight in fog. There we go, we'll start deployment. We like it dry. We like it dry. All right. We don't have any, um, any ballista hindering our progress here. So this should be relatively short, sweet, and easy to complete. Um, should be being the operative word. Um, we are just going to march. Oh, are you guys going to march? Oh, we're just going to march then right there, right there. Right there, and you guys fighting hanging over here, I guess. I don't know. Oh, is that it? Is that as far as you're gonna go? Alright, fine. Fuck you then. Move them there. There. I'll move you slightly to the right. Freak them out a little bit. I do think I wanna do this though. Double line that shit. Just, I like double line when you move around because it's just, for me, honestly, I think, I feel like it's easier to move when you are double lined. You know what I mean? When you're just navigating around shit. I mean, obviously, for a certain circumstance, like, obviously, when you're going to hit with your cavalry, you want to kind of envelop them and all that shit. And not necessarily, you know, kind of bunch up all that much sometimes. But, like I said, in, in terms of, uh, you know, just moving, navigating around uh, 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 opposition troops. And that's also one thing. I wish the fighting in this game was a little bit slower. Um, in all honesty, because sometimes it's... What you would like to do, like I said, is move around. Um, move around your... Move around the opposition. Move around the other infantry and shit. And if they had a bunch of infantry, obviously, you know, like I said... Moving around in just a single line can be a little difficult and and hazardous because you'll it's just hard to navigate them around shit. Which either the AI was smarter and wouldn't engage units and it would take a wide berth around units until you tell them to engage units. Because there will be times when you're walking your units around shit and they'll just run into them. You know, because they're just in a line formation, and you know the right flank will just kind of run into the enemy, and it's kind of lame, in my opinion, when you when when that shit happens. I personally like to um, let's actually speed this up. I actually would like to you know move around, like I said, in a double line formation, get behind them, and then as you charge or begin the charge, you know, change your formation to a line so you actually do envelop the enemy. Shit like that. That to me, you know, would be nice to to have that extra little bit of control. Because when you're doing this, when you're playing this real time, I mean, you know, it's kind of hard to give commands to all these guys, attack all these units, and then move these guys all around and still be, you know, issuing commands when these guys need new commands and shit. You know, at least in my honest opinion. Could be could be a little bit better. I do like how they're not firing at me at all. They're just like, we're skirts. I'm going to have you walk the fuck up and kick their asses. And kick their candy asses. Now I want you guys to. Now I want you to move on over here to the flankish, flankish area. And maybe, maybe move past them, mayhaps. See now they're gonna. Oh like, shit! Where do we go? Where do we go? Where do we go? Throw your evil shits. Baltasticals attack.
yeah. See what kind of happened there? No, oh, and see like this, like these guys, they're just on a move command and they're just kind of run into the enemy. Like I said, what they're doing now isn't terrible. Fucking... Jesus. Now we got this shit happening. Why don't you throw your shit at them? Fuck those guys. Fuck those guys. Those guys are assholes. Fucking skirmishing little shits. These guys. Oh, those guys are done. Now come back. Come back, my horsemen. And attack them. With divine fury. Who the fuck are you? Oh, you're over here. Where are you? <laughs> oh, they're right there. See, uh, problems, problems, problems. These guys just kind of stand there and like, I don't know what to do, eh? One of our units has used all its ammunition. Jesus, they use that ammo fast. They're throwing their shit like crazy. Throwing their shit like crazy. And these guys are about to get it right here. Probably should, you know, start from a deeper position, but... Just fucking run them over. Run them fuckers over. Blah. Give me your city. Because I said so. And now we have another. Now we've. Well, not another. But now we've finally completed that region. Now I don't know specifically where. Um. Specifically where their units are Um Like where the um oh shit The Fuck the Gallic The Gallic Confederation I don't know what they are right now I don't, I don't know if they've gotten to that point yet or not But anyway Those green fuckers That are in the Iberian Peninsula I don't know where their armies are at right now I mean, uh, a couple turns ago, we did see a couple relatively large armies move back north, back up into into Gaul and all that good shit. So hopefully they're still out there because what I want to do, and I'll show you here in a second, what I would really like to do, or actually what I'm going to do once we control this entire area. It's going to be wise. It's going to be actually the the Iberian Peninsula is a nice place to fortify, and that's why I want to stop here. So I did this uh, for a while on another another campaign where I was able to just uh well before I invaded uh the Iberian actually there's some good choke points there so like I said you'll see it in about two seconds when I when I show you so all right so now that we have Numantia we're gonna convert some settlement shit here I prefer uh you don't provide you just provide shit all right let's go with that uh, fuck it. Convert to that. I don't give a shit. I don't give no shits. Actually, I'm gonna tear you down. I'm gonna tear you down and put, like, a fucking farm here or some shit. Okay. What's really good about this place is you get two pretty good choke points. Um, yeah, one up here. Because I don't think, I don't think they can come. I mean, I think they can land right here. But I don't think they can walk through any any of this shit so you have a pretty good choke point over here i so said i think you can land here and walk this way. i don't know uh, i've never done it but that beach there i've um, never seen anyone do it either but that beach there insinuates that you can hop on land and start moving this way you know or potentially this way i don't really know point is point is this we can choke point this peninsula pretty well um this they can go through here but I believe in the winter it will cost lives. So, like I said, don't see anyone move through there too much. Now this, obviously, you can just put an army over here and kind of choke it off um, and, and fortify that location so they can't come down through there. Either way, they get stopped because they can't get through Taraco. So, lots of good shit there. So, anyway. And then, like I said, theoretically, everything here should be fairly well protected. I mean, they don't, they don't really send too many armies over water and then land on your beaches and shit. 
you know, they don't fucking pull some Normandy bullshit on your ass too often. So I'm not really that um, worried about something like that happening. Even so, we're probably still going to have some armies, you know, floating around. That'll help take care of that shit. Right? So, alright, this guy. Companion mercenary captain. Oh, I got some neat shit in here, don't I? I don't have any sword arm units. I got spears. I got spears. Ooh. I'm not a mercenary guy either. Hmm. Hmm. Lots of mercenary shit. Jesus. Oops. Now what I wanted. Ah, fuck it. It's fine. Don't care all that much. He's gonna have. He should have decent gravitas by the time we're done with him, because he should go and. Like I said, all right. So we're gonna end the turn right there. Um, watch. See, Rome. Rome just keeps doing weird shit over here. Like they keep waffling around. Like I said, I mean. On the first one, Rome had a real specific agenda. I mean, they really, they really did, you know, expand a lot. And late game, it was pretty much you versus Rome. And that's something I kind of liked. Like, early parts of the game, it was you versus someone else. I mean, one faction may actually get pretty big and, and shit. And then sometimes, you know, it really would stay around for a while, but... Ooh, yes. So, so here's the question. We have... Oh, we can. Oh, we can. Oh. That's fantastic. That's fantastic. Late Carthaginian Oplitites. better defense. Awesome. And it doesn't take much to retrain him either. I'm happy with that. I am happy with that. All that changes is his shield color. That's cute. Awesome. We have that done. That means we need to set a new one before we get going here. Alright, so we need to choose another thing to research. We'll go and research foreign policy. Because cultural conversion is always nice. And legal institutions, we have that, so we need to go. Military mint. Oh, damn. Damn, 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 damn. Alright. So. We have a late Carthaginian Alphates now. Um. Decisions, decisions. Decisions, decisions, decisions. All right, what have you got? You don't have much, but you've got enough to make this difficult. You have tribesmen. Oh my god, no mobs. Oh shit, lots of Iberian swordsmen. Hmm, I don't think I have. Well, shit. Um, what do we have? We got one, two, three, four, five, six. Even out the numbers. Recruit those two. I don't know. I don't know if that's really going to help me much. Because if they're... He's not recruiting anymore, though. Mm. Decisions, 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 decisions. Because this is going to be... This is going to be a pretty... Pretty tough fight. In all honesty. When we take over a... Good thing is... They've got the better... They've got the better, um... Walls, like... The more fun walls, I should say. Hmm. Hmm. The 
decisions, decisions, decisions. Goddamn. I don't know what to do. What I'm really worried about is this asshole right here. Skatari uh, Cavalry. Not really enthused about that asshole because what's going to happen is he's, he's probably going to be running around. And, you know, I won't pay attention and he'll attack me and fuck us up. That's what I'm afraid will happen. So should we wait one more turn? Should we wait one more turn? You know what might happen? Let's do something here. Fuck, I wish I could just like sneak around and snaggle a sepo. That would be nice. Nice, nice, nice indeed it would. Oof. Fuck. That's a great, great trait too. Jesus. Alalia has the military wharf going. Alright. Hmm. Fuck it, we're gonna wait one more turn. Ah, shit. I'm gonna wait one. Ooh, wait a minute. Can I. Can I. Can I. Let's try assaulting their patrol. Let's see if we can fuck their shit up. Oof. We fucked their Lusitani nobles up. Ooh. And them. Nice. Alright. I'm gonna end turn right here. And then, uh... And then I think we're gonna take try and take Abra, and then that'll be it. I think that's what's gonna happen. Really wish I had another army that I could use in reserve, too. That'd be nice. That would be nice. Yeah, see that? See how they're moving around up there? Yeah. Yeah. Good thing is, it's Arakillum and Nimi. Oh. What the fuck are you doing over there? I don't know what that asshole's doing. He's just standing there with his hand in the air. I think he's recruiting. It's not good for us. Not good for us at all. What we can do is this. But what we can do is this. Assault patrol again. Ooh, I wonder. Military subversion. Show of force. Let's assault their patrol again. Let's see if hopefully we get lucky and get their shit fucked up. All right, nice. So they're a little. Ooh, damn, they have had nothing in those nobles. That helps a lot. They did not recruit anything, so that means. This shit's ours. Yeah, this is going to be very, very brutal. Um, it's going to be pretty tough. But yeah. I've only got the four. I prefer just the four. I probably should, like, actually besiege the settlement. But I don't like the attritional losses on our side all that much. But that's really why. I think we can probably find a couple of good spots like last time you find us find us find ourselves a good spot to take the walls from luckily for us what we did is we took the most dangerous unit and reduced their numbers significantly that is the most dangerous unit that they have they only have one ranged unit I think although technically they can all throw shit at us and these guys aren't the veteran guys so I'm not so I'm not super worried about them, and we've got late Carthaginian Oplites, which is good for us. I think a little bit better defense. Um, yeah. Hopefully this works out well. Um, I'm still worried about that one unit. What I am going to do, though, is I'm going to use our cavalry to counter that. If they try to attack us from behind or some shit... Just swarm them with our cavalry and hope that they can handle them. Because that's really, that's really our best bet. Alright, you guys are going to be unit uno. Dos. Alright. Nope. Hmm. 
battle group of vet and quarters. Okay, all right. We don't want to attack them here. I don't really know. Not too many fucking towers. Jesus Christ. So what we really want to do, I believe, is this place over here. This isn't terrible, but you get that extra fucking tower. I love the fucking attack this spot over here, but fucking can't. So, yeah, I think we're, gonna, yeah, I think we're just going to do what we did last time we attacked a settlement of this design. And that's go over here. So. Actually, I'm going to put you right in the fucking middle. Bunch our, bunch our little asses all together. Um, I will have to keep an eye on... One of their units. Or if I see anything behind us or anything of that nature. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Yeah, I know. Those are dicks. So. Alright, hopefully our ladders don't run into each other here. Right, they don't have much from ranged, but they do have a ton of units. But we're hopefully going to punch a hole right here and climb on up there and I don't know, put our horses over there. Just so they're close by so that Okay, so do we have anything behind us? This is always what fucking happens to me. Is got guys reinforcements come from like right over here and start fucking our shit up. Bastards. Every fucking time. Bastards. Hate him. Mm hmm. Jesus, you guys are slow. So I'll hold you guys up for here for a second. So I want these guys to kind of go in first. Because I don't want these guys standing over there without the wall, without the walls, without the ladders being up. It's really what it is. I still want them. Hanging out for too long with, with no ladders. With no ladders, we need ladders. So our first unit, uh, whichever the first ladder gets there and is up on the wall, that's where the first group of Oplates is gonna is gonna join the fight. And then the second one, I want to put over here. Jesus Christ! So many units. So many units. So little time. Lucky for us. Yes. All of you go in the same general area. That's something too. I like I like the ladders a lot more because I don't know. I just do. It seems to go quicker and seems to be not super painful. Like I don't know. Plus you don't have the the fear of them catching fire and shit. I fucking hate when that happens. So irritating. It's like, God fucking damn it! Quit catching fire! Bitches. What we can do is we use. See, I still don't see that fucking unit of cavalry. It frightens me. I'm scared, man. Jesus. Oh, yeah, you guys are throwing shit up there. Alright, so we want you. Alright, go time. Get up on them walls, bitches. Yeah, because I think we're going to put... Yeah. Jesus, these guys are eating up over there. All sorts of shit thrown at them. Also, why are both of you on the same spot? Fuck it, just drop the fucking thing and get up there. It doesn't fucking matter. Go, just get up there. Just get the fuck up there. You guys stop standing where they can shoot shit at you. Yeah, let's see, 
We're actually moving quite along, moving along quite well here. And hopefully, hmm, might do that sooner rather than later. One of our units has used all its ammunition. And they're still getting shot at by fucking towers. Wonderful, wonderful towers. Move. Uh, that's one thing I fucking hate. They just fucking stand there when you besiege shit. They just stand there and just get shot at by stuff. It's really irritating. It's like, really? Can you just not get shot at all day? That'd be great. Right? I mean, just saying. I don't want to put these fuckers up here. That's what we're gonna do? Why are you getting shot at? Seriously, how? 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 How the fuck? Okay. So one thing that does make the Lusitani uh, kind of difficult to deal with is they've got so much, like a lot of their units have, you know, the ability to shoot range shit at you, even though they're melee. Really, really can hamper you, slow you down sometimes. It's kind of, uh, kind of annoying. It makes attacking them and shit very difficult. Actually, what I want you to do is that... Yes, minions, do my bidding. Do my bidding. Where's their... I thought I saw their nobles or something like that over here somewhere. Did they get routed already or not? Throw your shit at those assholes. Because they're dicks. I don't like them. Fuck those guys. Is that no? It was just Siberians, Katari, Spearmen, more swordsmen. Not I saw. Like I said, nobles in here or something, or veterans or some shit. Thought I saw some shit I didn't like in here, but I guess I guess we took care of that. Kind of want this unit to at least sort of survive, so that we have someone to. Take over that shit. Why are you down there? Not really missiles anymore. You guys are all fucking... Get all defensive and shit. Yeah, things are going pretty well. We might get lucky and not lose any units, but I don't think that'll happen. I think we'll still lose a few. There we go. It's this guy that I was looking for that I saw. And it's you guys who I want to throw. Throw your shit at them. Yes. Throw your shit at them. It should be, yes, it should be. It's been turning in our favor in all honesty. You guys are starting to fucking take hits because you're all getting meleeified. I really want to get these fucking cavalry in here soon. There we go, now we're losing. Losing? Dropping some of them. Oh my god, there you are. <laughs> Gotta love it. I do like the fucking Peltists a little bit. These guys aren't, aren't bad. I've kind of, they've, they've grown on me, in all honesty. Oh, come on, route, route, you motherfuckers, route. Yes, lots of shit. Oh, are we, are we seriously going to get it? Seriously going to get some good shit here. 
Yes, yay. Everything is ratting. Awesome. Go here and not attack the... Why would you attack? I want you to just... Come over here and... Where are these guys are going? It's beyond me. Ooh, you know what I am going to do? Because I'm awesome. Watch this shit. Watch this shit. Go fuck those guys up. <laughs> Let's see if we can get you fuckers on the walls. If I'm responsible here enough, we can actually save these units if I'm responsible enough. Enough. Ah, fuck. You guys are gonna get hammered by that goddamned thing over there. That. That. That fucking thing. Damn tower. I hate those towers. I hate towers. I hate them so much. Ah, uh, see, there's that guy. That dickhead. Not a fond friend of his. Nope. Go after them fuckers. Kill them. Route them. Route them hard. Oh yeah, look at that. Look who look who has this shit now, bitches. Go control that thing, because somehow they still control it. <laughs> and you know what we are going to do with this cavalry. Oh, wait. That's what we need to tackle, huh? This little spot right here this time. Alright. Yeah, take that from them. Fuck those guys. You're the unit that actually is kind of alive. I like how they're sort of kind of routing, but not quite. Might be able to keep these fuckers just maybe. Fuckers. There we go. We got some routing ish already. That's kind of quick. Though. Considering they're not really. Jesus, look how many fucking casualties these guys took just from fucking taking that tower. Good lord. Good fucking lord. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Yeah, see, it's a good thing we took this guy out. Because, yeah, now he's really no real threat to us here now at the end at the end you know, and we may we may if we're lucky and things hold out for the next whatever till we kill these two units we may may just may get out of here without losing any units that's gonna be awesome the enemy general is dead. all right that's one down come on Fuck these guys. You see, look at that. Like, we've killed two of them. The entire time we've been fighting these guys, all fucking eight of them, we've killed two of them. Two. Two, goddammit. Two. There we go. Now they're finally routed. Alright. Look at that. I believe we will end up holding on to every single one of our units. I believe. I think. I don't think they'll rout. Or be fucking whatever. Destroyed. I shouldn't be. Damn it. Should have all fucking 20. That's good. Good shit. Pretty happy about that, actually. Very happy. 
See? Not not bad. Not bad at all. Like I said, very, very happy with the way that turned out. That's awesome. So anyhow, we have Ebera now. Um, next up is Ola Sipo. Ola Sipo is a nice little summon because they usually have um, uh, like upgraded mines and shit there or upgraded mines upgraded like blacksmiths and shit so we can then take our units over there and um upgrade their armor and shit which is what we will do um we may actually uh just like rotate our armies through there um um before we uh or while they're um you know while fortifying this area for us once we conquer all of the iberian and all that good shit because, um, it's good stuff. Shit you want, shit you need. Because, yeah, that, that is one thing I wish they'd actually let you do. I wish they'd have actually let you invest the money in a blacksmith instead of having it be regional. It's kind of weird, like, the way it's, like, only certain settlements can. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Alright then. Look at that. All of this shit. Convert to that. And eh, probably could use a fucking. Oh yeah, you've got all that shit. Oh, the barbarians. Oh, how I miss barbarians. Marksman's range. Oh, interesting. Oh, interesting. They're very. This. The Carthage is very Greek, I've noticed. Like a lot of. Greek units and shit that they've borrowed and put into them in this game. But anyhow. Alright, so... So yeah, whenever... I think it's wherever you have uh, iron or whatever. That that resource is where the blacksmiths and shit are built. Um, so now, we have... Ebra. Happy about that. Very happy about that. Um, soon, since we already have... Uh, oh shit, we gotta, we gotta fucking do that. Mantia, oh, you already have that being built, so let's go with homesteads. All right, anyhow, um, so I think that does it for this episode. Uh, you made it this far on YouTube. You know what to do. Like, subscribe, comment, all that good shit. Bye now.